1965, 2015 50 Jahre FCM, lass die Fahne jetzt in Wind wehen Du bist unser Stolz, heb die Arme, lass den Club leben Die Bestie war nie weg, es wird für immer unser Club leben Wir stehen geschlossen hinter dir, die blaue Wand steht für den Osten Die Fans sind ja im Verein und verlassen die den Posten Hart auf Fossen, komm nach Magdeburg und du kannst es lieber kosten Wir sind verantwortlich guys welcome back this is episode number five i'm recording this on the same night of the previous episode i've just got into got into it and i've thought right, i really wanted to play this game against uh, schmenitzer um they've had a bit of change in fortunes really so they were top and we were third i think when the episode finished we've been on a great run um and they've been on a bit of a a bit of a slide so we're in great position what we're nine nine points clear with um 16 games to go our form has been since the the draw, the two draws that we had in the last two live comms, we've we've picked up one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight wins, eight wins out of nine. Um, obviously, them two were friendlies, um, but still decent performance. My only issue is I'm still not hundred percent on attacking direct long ball. Sometimes it works like this game here. These this team was second bottom, and we didn't we didn't dominate. Look at that, fifty seven percent. You know, we were on mix. We should be dominating these games. This game here, the last game that I've, I've literally just played two minutes ago, we should have been we should have been well beaten. They had five clear-cut chances. We were awful. We were absolutely awful. Um, so we're struggling against the the sort of like the lesser teams, and I'm putting more men forward and stuff. It's not working. So today's game, this is what we've been playing. Duke has been in great form, the, the target man. He hasn't scored actually for three three league games, but he's in decent form. He's got a hat trick and then he got himself a brace. Um, Best is come back in at left back. Turpies is on a bit of a downward spiral. Um, but once again, because of qual lack of quality in the squad, he's playing. Um, and he does pop up with a goal now, now and again. Or gets himself into, into decent chances. So we're going to fly with it. Um... I'm hoping. I'll be surprised that we don't get promoted. We're nine, what nine, nine point clear with sixteen games to go, and we're we're getting through games without being dominant. We'll see how this goes. So this is the team that turned us over at the start of the season. What was it five, five two? So a little bit of revenge. Here we go. Oh. <laughs> 13 seconds gone. Duca. What a start. <laughs> that will do. I have been sort of like going counter as well for the last sort of like 20 minutes. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't work. My previous saves, like the saves, obviously the private saves, I don't tend to change a great deal. This is the first one for a while. I've maybe just faffed faffed about with stuff a bit too much. I think sometimes you can over overthink a few things and do too much instead of just letting the game play. You know, end of day and I'm being faffing and we're still second, so I'm, I just need to find something a bit settled. Oh, how was that not a free kick? They'll score from here. Yeah, fucking referee. <sighs> That's frustrating. First shot. But once again, defence just massive gaps. Right through the middle. So we half an hour played. No possession as usual. I just never feel like we're in any kind of control of a game. On Edison, Rother. Oh, that's bloody crap. Oh, when we give the ball away, really annoying. I'm going to cosh a bit here. 
Oh, I have to, I'm just going to play a little bit, a little bit narrow, I think. There we go. Fuck's sake. Sorry for my bad language, but it's really frustrating. Especially when you take the lead after what, 14, 15 seconds. What are we going to do? What are we going to do? This is another game where just again just pump it, yeah, bugger it. Go for a pump. Bit of pumpage. <clears throat> oh, it's gone in. Is that gonna be disallowed? Oh, it's gone in. The keeper's made an absolute hash of it. We got lucky in the last game. Got to say the last game the winner was another absolute Mayb back pass goalkeeper and he kicked it against our striker and it went in from like two yards. So we on fifty five played. Might look at doing a couple of subs, but then once again we're sort of like limited. I would maybe bring an attacking midfielder on. I don't want to shove another uh, when I'm chasing games I do shove another striker up and just route one, but I don't want to leave three players so high might do is I'm just going to drop it onto counter take off the, that one see how we get on <clears throat> it's a punt good nod down by Beck Schmed here we go Duca keepers flapped at it oh, oh, we've turned it round we've turned it round <clears throat> Turpitz I actually warned him just before the last game uh, I'll continue with that. Um, before the last game, that his form was crap. He has just really dips, dips of like 6.2 and then whoop, up to 7.5. He'll have three games where he's awesome and three games. I would take him out, but once again, we're, we're, we're really bare in them attacking areas. Oh, could get another. Okay. Some of which we'll sort out in the summer. There'll be, there'll be a good maybe 10 players leaving in the summer. Duke has signed a new contract. Um, he was, oh no, oh. Duca was, contract was expiring at the end of the season, he's only 21, but he wanted a pay jump of 1,000, from 1,000 of Europe, and he's gone up to four and a half grand, and that took a lot of, a lot of de um, sorting out, he wanted promotion, wage, really, um, increase, and a lot, right, what are we going to do, let's do a little sub, let's get Low Kemper on. Oh, is he going to give us it? Oh, I thought he was going to give us it then. Best each shred. Rother. Edison. Edison's quieting down a little bit. Last few last few games. There we go. 4-3. I think he's coming off and all, isn't he? Yeah, we'll get him off. Get Long Kemper on. He does seem to stretch it a little bit. He must have a little bit more pace, Long Kemper. Ooh. This is a big win if we can hold out, boys. Clearance booted. Oh, he's in. Look, here we go. Stretch it, stretch it. Oh, he's in a stanch. Decent, decent strike. <laughs> we will have to watch that one again. Let's pause it. I can't do it all. Look at that there. Look at that. Ready? Bosh! On the volley. Have some of that. Shred 5-3. The game done.
still not convincing. You know, we've had to come from behind, but just keep churning out these wins. Hopefully, it'll be a lot different next year in the league above, and I get my own players in. A few more options in all areas, really. We're a bit. We've got like six centre halves and two defensive midfielders that won't even touch, won't even play. A um, couple of wing backs as well that just won't play. Let's see where that's put us. That's put us top. What I'll do is, guys, because it because it's a Friday night game, we'll 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 chug it on a little bit and see where we are, and then we'll go through a few little things. I'm only going to do with one game today, um, but we'll go through the squad in a little bit more detail. What I what I was planning to do for um, January transfer, but there's not much about. Catch you in a minute, guys. Guys, so we are second position still, one point off Carl Carl Ruther. We're a point ahead, um, nine clear of that again, which is good. Schedule wise, I think I'll play. I will come back pretty early. We'll come back. We've got to play that one in the next game. We'll do a little double header, that one on Untervatchin, and then what I think I'll do is I'll play another load to get us right through to the end of the season. Um. Squad-wise, though, there is a fair few contracts expiring. We've got Glinka, the goalie. He has done well this year, but he's 34 and he's declining look, so I'm probably going to let him go. Um, Hainault, not played. A center half, one of the centre-halves is not used. Um, he's going. Gerrit Muller, he's, that is an issue for me, that there. Um, I do like my... Wingers and wide men, you know, you've got to have a bit of pace. Um, Saliso, I think I will. He's, he's 35. I will offer him. He's only, he's only on 900, so I'm hoping that he won't want too much. I tend to drag the ones out and not too bothered about till the end of the season. You tend to get them a little bit cheaper. Um, and then another one, Richard Richard Veal. He's a, one of them defending midfield that I spoke about. He's he's going to go. Um, Shved, he will probably stay because he's, he's doing decent so far, but... He wants a massive. What's, what's he wanting? I think three eight, which is in, is not too bad. But I thought right, save a bit of cash. I'll um let it out for a little bit more. Let him suffer. Um, he's on loan. I'm not sure. Does his contract? When's his contract run out? Oh, he's got ages yet. I'm hoping he's a player though that I can get get back in on loan. Erdmund, another one will go. Um, decent stats, ball winning, but all he can play is that. Um, and I have got the three Rother, um, Edison, and uh, the captain Saliso, so he'll probably go. Um, Schiller, he's another one that I'll probably be just hang on to, depending on what he wants at the end of the season. Um, he ain't doing too bad, but I, I think we need to strengthen it centre half areas. Um, and then that's it. Everyone else is staying. I will try and transfer list. There's a couple that I will be transfer listing. Um, he wants to go. Let him go. Um, he'll go. He'll go. Probably not the goalie just because he's young. Um, and he's a, a trend in the, the club thing. So I'll keep on him. Um, he'll potentially go as well. Um, no, sorry, him. Costly. He's only he's only seven eighteen. But once again, he's not, well, it says that, but he's got a fair bit. A fair bit to do. The youngster who we got the Marlon Marlon Drews actually broke his leg. He's out for another but he'd started to pick up look. So for a fifty six well he was fifteen, he turned sixteen after he got injured, but um his stats aren't too bad for German division. How are we doing? Look at that, top, we're top. Most I think most of these clubs are the same sort of standard though, so it's not not to shout about. Um I'm hoping we'll get a decent um influx of talent soon so that's it guys thanks for watching please subscribe to the channel drop us a like any comments will be muchly appreciated as always and i will see you for the next one